There's a time breach around here for sure, mate. And it's not petite. I hope you're sure about this. For your sake, I mean. Close. Give me a shake, eh? There it is. After you, I guess. Hope you ate something light. I use this staff to make right what once went wrong. Who stops tearing her apart? Things are about to get very weird, mate. An intruder in the Emperor's sanctum? To me, slay the invaders. A Josasha from an alternate timeline? She doesn't look happy. Is vulnerable. Now seal it up tight. What is this? Magic? You will pay for summoning me weakly. Another angry Josaja incoming. She brought her brother along. Another breach to seal. Talk to you, hero. The Staff of Towers, at last. Time is mine to control. You will not stand in my way. Just the breach. That's the last of them. Seal it! It's over. Good work. For a meat brain, I mean. Josaja, you're alive. I fully expected is what Is it? Came. You know why, Initiate. Everyone knows why. I looked at the Staff of Towers and saw a world without consequences. A world where no sin, small or large, would go unpunished. Where nothing broken was beyond repair. I... I was wrong. I know. But some pain... Some pain runs so deep that it blinds you, weakens your senses, makes you believe in the impossible. Have you ever felt a pain like that? What's time compared to all the people you love? It doesn't make sense, I know. No, and they shouldn't. I betrayed the Loremaster's confidence. Betrayed the old ways. Everything the Sijics stand for. No, I will face my justice. I will accept the punishment, whatever it is.
So, our adventure is coming to an end, eh? Look, can we... Can we talk in private? The Athenaeum, maybe? It won't be a moment. Thanks, mate. I know you've got other adventures ahead, but I wanted to just take a moment and speak face to... Crystal sort of face. Our deal, what else? When we set out, I held you to a promise. You said if I helped you, you'd try to keep me out of the Sigic Vault. Well, I helped. So? <laughs> I knew you were clever. In answer to your direct question, yes, I know what you'll do. But I want you to look at me when you say it. So you're also saying it to yourself, see? A moment of truth and self-reflection. How exciting. Ah, the hero demures. Well, I suppose we'll find out soon enough. Got enough of that. This might be our last farewell, mate. What's the custom? That's in a vessel full of that swell you pour down your face all and saying something saccharine? Yeah, of course. I could do with a bit of quiet and fresh air. Your bag, while cozy, is very, very loud. Did I? Does an oblique cogniform have infinite angles? <laughs> Please don't hurt yourself. The answer is yes. It was great. The sights, the smells, the incessant jingle of all your gear on my face. Dream come true, mate. <laughs> no. Truth is, I've always known you bipeds have potential. Sure, most of you just stumble through your laughably short lives, making smaller versions of yourselves, urinating, cobbling shoes, I don't know. But every so often, there's a you. Sure. Must be hard, though, knowing you're a lion among endless hordes of baby-rearing, urinating, shoemaking sheep. How you keep them just slaughtering them all and conquering this place, I'll never know. Not that I advocate that sort of thing. That, my friend, depends entirely on you. If you put me back into the vault, I'll spend my days plotting another escape. In between bouts of violently cursing your name and swearing revenge, of course. And I suppose I'll find a new bag to settle in. Maybe Josage is. I always liked her. And I think she's already got one boot out the door. She might not be quite as adventurous as you, but I'd take anyone over another century of boring questions. You know, the fact you didn't make your mind up about this 30 or so time breaches ago gives me cause to worry. I don't stew over it, mate. Either way, I'll make do. It's another few hundred years in the grand scheme of things, eh? So, back into the bag I go, eh? Fair enough. Just try to make a little more room, all right? I like lumps of ore and rodent meat as much as the next trans-dimensional entity, but it gets ridiculous in there sometimes. Ah, does my heart good to see you, Initiate. The events of the last few days, I must admit, they have taken a toll. I was just preparing Josage's proclamation of banishment. Not a simple task, I can tell you. Surely this comes as no surprise. She deceived me in the right, Master, stole an artifact of unimaginable power, and very nearly broke time itself. Exile is our only recourse. This brings me no joy. I can't... Relic Master Glenadier sealed it in the vault of Moawita, and there it will remain. So long as I draw breath, that staff will never again see the light of day. I would not have entered into such a bargain, but given the circumstances, I understand. The Augur served us well, but we cannot permit objects of such power to roam free in Tamriel. In the wrong hands, its gift of foresight could prove costly. A bold suggestion, considering her recent exploits. Still, Josage is thirsty for answers, and the Augur is bound to provide honest counsel. Yes. Yes, this may work. The Augur...
It's beautiful, isn't it? Even after all these years, I'm still in awe of this place. And now I'll never see it again. Forgive me. We both know this is a fate I brought upon myself. Is there something you need, Initiate? He... He'd entrust this to me? After all I did? How I disappointed him? I don't know what to say. Actually, come to think of it, I do. I will never disappoint my mentor again. I may be exiled, but the Augur and I will make a better world. You don't know what this means to me. To have a friend on such a lonely journey. Thank you. I hope you'll see me off. I'm to meet the lore master at the portal to Tamriel. That is unusual. It was my understanding that the Augur's work was concluded. Does Kellerus plan to use it for some other purpose? To Sasha? Well, that is an unlikely choice. But I defer, of course. Kellerus was blind to her motives before, but he knows her heart quite well now. Of that, I am certain. If he thinks she is equal to the task, so be it. Thank you for informing me. disappointing you. Well, I guess this is goodbye. I'll take good care of the auger. You have my word. Thank you for everything. I deserve this exile, but I don't think I will ever deserve a friend like you. Take care of the order for me, all right? First, I think I'll go home to the Alakir. I have a lot of ghosts to confront, choices to make peace with. Changing the past was always a mirage. All we can do is face it and persevere. I'll do what I can to ease my family's burdens, to rebuild a sense of hope and set them back on the path to happiness. Then, travel. Definitely travel. As much as I love this place, there's a whole world to explore out there. The time has come. Rest easy. I'm certain that both Josaja and the Augur will be fine. No, they will do better than that. They will thrive. Now you reap the harvest of your good works. Through your dedication and heroism, you have proved your worthiness. So I present this final gift. Beyond this, there is nothing I can teach you. Let the old ways proclaim. You are now a true Sijic. Farewell.